morning, everyone. My name is Jonathan Guzman. So the first question is, how did I uh, come to Jesus as your personal Savior? And I really didn't understand what relationship with Jesus was since you could not see him or, or touch him. Um, I did go to church quite often with my grandmother. And it was a Catholic church, and I didn't understand as a kid what, what it meant. Um, now that I've been coming to celebration for a few months, I've been able to process and understand who Jesus is as a personal Savior. He has been by my side my entire 44 years. I've had some serious ups and downs and failed many times, but things always seem to work out, even if I have to hit rock bottom. It's not myself or my mom or my kids. Yes, they're a big help, and I love them all. Jesus has helped me make it this far and con continues to push me to do the right thing. <clears throat> that is why I find Jesus is my personal savior. In regards to the baptism, I have never been baptized. I grew up thinking you commit all the sins you want, get baptized, and they're all washed away. That's wrong. <laughs> so, I know that my thoughts of doing everything wrong could not be erased <clears throat> by things I have sinned for. I have a seven-year-old son, and I'm pretty much a full-time father of him, and I would like him to learn about our Savior and get baptized down the road also. I'm doing this now because I truly believe that I have Jesus in my heart, and I just didn't did not realize how close he always has been to me. I want to walk with him and have a relationship that I can turn to my Savior and talk and pray to and give thanks for everything, even if it's not perfect. I'm excited for this new journey, and I look forward to a closer relationship with my Savior.